10 ways to naturally boost your energy. In this video, we'll be taking a look at 10 effective strategies to overcome fatigue and tiredness and to boost your energy levels naturally. Throughout this video, you'll be learning why you may be feeling worn down even after you've had a good night's sleep, how to get long-lasting energy without the need for stimulants like caffeine, coffee or energy drinks, and how you can maximise energy output from your cells. Just a quick reminder, this video is for educational purposes only, so do speak to your doctor if you have any medical concerns. 1. Thiamine One of the most important causes of tiredness and fatigue is not having enough vitamin B1 or thiamine that's active inside your body. So start eating more foods rich in B1 on a daily basis, such as nutritional yeast, sunflower seeds, organic pork, garlic, asparagus and squash. Vitamin B1 can boost energy output from the little powerhouses inside your cells called the mitochondria. If you wish, you could also start taking a daily supplement of 50 mg of allithiamine or 13 mg of thiamine cocarboxylase to increase your energy output. Number 2 is Lemon Balm Tea if you often feel stressed, fearful, anxious or you struggle to sleep at night, these issues may be causing burnout and fatigue and tiredness throughout the day. So start drinking one cup of organic lemon balm tea every single morning, making sure to steep this tea for at least 10 minutes before drinking. This powerful adaptogen calms down the nervous system balances cortisol and it also turns off the fight or flight response so that your body can recover from long-term emotional stress or poor sleep by restoring balance to the body. If you wish, you could also take a supplement of ashwagandha. This is another powerful adaptogen herb which can help the body adapt to stress and increase energy. 3. Increase Ketones Another very effective way to boost your energy levels naturally is by increasing the amount of ketones in your body. You can do this by fasting for 18 hours per day and eating your food in a strict 6 hour window. Fasting helps your body to turn fat into ketones which are a much better fuel source for your cells and mitochondria than glucose. If you wish you can also take exogenous ketones by consuming virgin coconut oil as this oil contains medium chain triglycerides which are converted into ketones in the body. I recommend that you simply start cooking with raw coconut oil instead of vegetable oil as this is an easy way to get it into your diet and boost up your energy. Coconut oil also supports the immune system in fighting off viruses and infections that may also be making you feel tired. If you're liking this information, please hit the like button, subscribe and turn all notifications on to stay updated with my latest health and nutrition tips. Moving on now to number 4, reduce caffeine. When we feel tired, it's very easy to reach out for a coffee, a can of soda or an energy drink to give us that little bit of energy that we need. Unfortunately, this is an illusion because caffeine only helps to make you feel less tired it doesn't actually provide more energy from your cells. In fact, long-term caffeine use can deplete vitamin B1 and it also raises cortisol, causing more tiredness, stress, irritability, anxiety and sleeping difficulties that have been a big problem for myself over the years. So what you want to do is reduce your caffeine intake to one cup of coffee in the morning and consider using adaptogen coffees instead made from mushrooms or dandelion roots throughout the day. The fifth tip is very simple but this will also boost your energy, eat red meat. Anemia is a condition where you don't have enough iron, vitamin B12 or folate so your red blood cells stop working properly. This causes less oxygen to be transported through your body, making you feel extremely exhausted, tired, pale skinned and fatigued. So start eating a serving of 6 ounces of grass fed beef steak at least 4 times per week to boost your heme iron and B12 levels. You also want to make sure that you're including some greens on your plate like arugula, asparagus, avocado or broccoli to provide the folate that you need. 
This very simple meal can boost oxygen flow around your body, which is an important part of the fuel used by your mitochondria to produce energy inside your cells. Now, number six isn't for everyone, but trust me, it definitely works. Cold showers. Start taking a cold shower for one to two minutes in the morning to stimulate this massive boost of energy and cognitive function throughout the day. This healthy shock to the cold has been shown in studies to increase the number of mitochondria in the cells, which can output more energy. Cold therapy also reduces muscle soreness, getting rid of aches and pains, and it improves sleep quality on the evening by helping to reset your circadian rhythm, which is your body clock. If you find this really, really hard to do or it's impossible, you may need some vitamin B1 to help your body adapt to the changing temperature. Now, moving on to number seven, which is also very important, electrolytes. Most people don't get enough electrolyte minerals in their diet by eating leafy green vegetables, especially potassium and magnesium, and this can leave them feeling very tired with weaker muscles and chronic fatigue. So to boost your electrolytes, start eating more salad vegetables to get magnesium and potassium, and be sure to add some sea salt for your sodium chloride and a little grass-fed cheese for your calcium. To further boost up your electrolytes, you can also use a high quality electrolyte powder, which contains at least 1000 milligrams of potassium citrate, and I'll put some links down below for your convenience. You'll soon begin noticing that by boosting your electrolytes, you'll be less waterlogged as swelling and fluid will be released from your body and your nerve signals will also increase, making you feel more energetic, mentally focused and alert. Tip number eight is to support your thyroid. Another potential reason that you feel worn down and tired all of the time is because of an underactive thyroid gland. You see, the thyroid in your neck makes very important hormones that control your metabolism and your energy levels. So if you get yourself tested and you find that you do have an underactive thyroid, which is called hypothyroidism, not hyperthyroidism, you may need to start taking larger doses of vitamin D3, along with eating seafoods that are rich in iodine and selenium to overcome the weakness in this gland. You could also take bile salts, which can help to improve the conversion of thyroid hormones inside your liver. Tip number nine is intense exercise. Short bursts of high intensity exercise are much healthier for the body than doing large sessions of cardio. High intensity interval training has been shown in studies to improve the amount of energy factories or mitochondria inside your muscle cells. So this makes your body more efficient at producing energy and keeping your muscles strong as you get older. To do this form of training, you want to raise your heart rate for brief bursts like 10 seconds and then rest for 50 seconds to bring it back down and do this a few times till you build up a tolerance. The rest part is more important than the exercise itself because recovery is where the body adapts to this healthy level of stress that we call exercise. And the last one here is oregano oil. There are certain infections like Epstein-Barr virus, cytomegalovirus, herpes and others that can cause long-term fatigue and tiredness. In order to help put these viruses and infections into remission, it's important to focus on lowering your stress as we talked about in point one and point two of this video. After handling your stress, you may also want to take a course of wild oregano oil from Pearl Capsules for two to three weeks to help boost your immune system. Oregano oil can speed up white blood cell activity to trap, engulf and destroy pathogens in your body, which may also help to boost your energy and overcome lung bouts of fatigue and weakness. Absorbing nutrients. Now, as we get older, especially after 50, our bodies tend to produce less stomach acid and enzymes which causes poor digestion. This can cause issues like indigestion, acid reflux and bloating most commonly. These symptoms indicate that we may not be absorbing the vitamins and the minerals that we need properly, causing tiredness, weakness in the muscles, fatigue, stress and brain fog and difficulty concentrating. To overcome these issues, you can simply start taking one tablespoon of apple cider vinegar before each meal of the day. 
This liquid helps to strengthen the quality of your digestive juices so that you may break down and absorb vitamin B1, potassium, magnesium, protein, fats and all of the other nutrients. Acetic acid from the vinegar is also converted into ketones which can feed your cells and repair the gut lining against any damage that you may have. So for a quick summary, here are the 10 most effective ways to boost your energy levels naturally. Consume vitamin B1 rich foods like nutritional yeast on a daily basis. Drink lemon balm tea to combat stress and restore energy and balance. Increase ketones by fasting, eating low carb foods or consuming coconut oil. Reduce your caffeine intake which may be burning you out. Overcome anemia by eating more grass fed red meat with salad on the side. Use cold showers in the morning to increase the number of energy factories in your cells. Consume electrolytes by eating salad with sea salt or use a powdered electrolyte drink. Support your metabolism and your thyroid by taking vitamin D3 and eating seafoods which contain iodine and selenium. Use high intensity interval training to boost the mitochondria in the muscles. Use wild oregano oil to clear out infections in the body that may be making you weak. Strengthen your stomach acids to boost energy with apple cider vinegar. And one more that I'd like to add, smile. Don't take life too seriously and try to have a little fun at least once a day. I've also made a more in-depth video covering vitamin B1 to stop feeling tired. So if you'd like to learn more, go ahead and tap on this video that's on your screen now. Thank you so much for your support and watching this video today. And as always, I wish you great health, wealth and happiness.